Okay, uh, I think we'll go with Res Infinite uh, now. This is the second PlayStation and I'm, I'll try to finish it in one go because I'm not gonna survive the third one after the editing and stuff like that. Uh, so, let's go. <laughs> this is just fucking rough. Like, a roller coaster in a hurry. I mean, still, I pay attention to the details, like, you know, the audio stick and stuff like that, because uh, I am like that. I can't really, like, post shit on my channel, even though I post, like, kind of photosynthesity. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, I have to have a video that uh, really, like, works, and you can actually, like, watch it. Even though there are, like, 100 releases, I have to kind of pay attention to the details, like just syncing the audio, which is a very big problem in Quest and uh, just visuals and stuff like that, so... Oh shit, oh my god, I'm gonna fall! What the hell? That was so ominous, but so cool! Whoa, okay. First of all, I have no idea what what this game is about, so I'm literally just going for it. <laughs> game settings, language, music. Oh Jesus! I. Whoa. Okay. Uh, via control type, trigger shot. Advanced. Okay. Well, it tells tells me literally nothing, so we'll just go to the game. Play rest or play arena X. Okay, just... But, but how to play? <laughs> Controls. All viruses and projectile screens will be destroyed for a limited time. Lock on fire. Okay, maybe I I hope there's gonna be like... Yeah, no. What? Okay, so. Move the VR headset to look around the world. So we're like a uh, character in space. Steering and I guess shooting stuff. Lock on laser to progress throughout the game. Destroy network openings to proceed to deep layers. You begin the level at evolution 1. When you take damage, your evolution couch drops. Viruses attack by frame projectiles at you. You can't dodge these projectiles, so you must shoot and destroy them to avoid taking damage. Oh, okay, 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 okay. okay. Overdrive items. I wish the tutorial would be, you know, like visual that you do, not like just reading stuff. That's like anti, anti gameplay for me. Okay, this is the story, but if you care about it, pause. But I can't. I don't. I I really <laughs> just have to go. Wait. This is the same shit. How to start? Oh, play. Oh, thank you. Okay. So, the, the, okay. Wait, what? Okay, so I shoot like that. I think. Wow. Whoa. Wait, is this like a rhythm game kind of? I'm gonna try like a uh, uh, play like a pistol whip. <laughs> this is definitely a sitting game because there's no point for me standing up. So we just destroy like targets uh, on the screen. That's pretty much it. And we progress f with those kind of cubes that we see. See? Yeah. We have to just shoot it a few times to progress. And uh, this, like, I don't know, square shape is like our aim, but, but it's kind of auto aim. So it's not necessarily that we have to aim precisely. We just kind of have to 
have an idea to shoot. This is like trippy, but like the environment is pretty cool to look at. And the music is kinda going with it. It reminds me of like, I mean, I have not been born in those times, but like a very old school arcade games with like a joystick, right? To kinda shoot the targets. Like very old school um, wave, wave shooters. Oh. Whoa! Oh my god, don't spin me like that! Ah, this is a boss, okay. Oh, she does a, a missile! What? what? <laughs> I'm pressing as fast as I can! <laughs> yeah, this HP bar is pretty large, not gonna lie. This is pretty cool. I mean, it's definitely something out of my comfort zone. But I am enjoying it more than Tetris, to be fair. But at the same time, I'm not at Tet- <gasps> Did I die? Oh wait, I'm a ball now. Yay! Jesus! And that was area one, seems like it. What the hell was that? Shoot down 100%. Support item. I didn't even, like, I, the game was too just chaotic to even pay attention of what is happening. Yeah. So I'm assuming this essentially Tetris effect, but uh, as a wave clear kind of shooter, which is more in my style. Uh, it's not something that you would like kind of do a playthrough of it, uh, but uh, definitely interesting. Okay, I'm enough of this. <laughs> we have things to do. Um, cool. I think the most uh, like a good summary of this game is just cool. Not for me, but like, just cool. And uh, so, let's go to the next one!